Are you serious? Actually, Tekin told me. So wait, you're saying that Ruzgar got in a fight for Kutai then? Hey, go for that wild guy instead. And as for Kutai, who cares? You were telling me that Kutai gathered himself up and returned to normal. No way. Honestly, he had gathered himself up, but apparently lost again, considering that he saw Zainab and Ruzgar together. Actually, I think Kutai won't pull himself together for a while. That's just how he is. When I get sad about Kutai, <laughs> I just have to laugh. <laughs> <laughs> Right, girls. I think it's no laughing matter, Basak. I'm sorry. What's bothering you, sweetie? I don't know, girl. I don't want Katai to be so evil. That's all it is. <sighs> Honey, I don't have to remind you the thing he did to you, do I? I know. I'm still angry at him, but well... I don't want him to feel so much pain either. I want everyone to live normal lives, to be happy. Both for me and Katai. Ruzgar, though. I wonder if it's Ruzgar who you're actually worried about. Or if you're wondering whether he'll stay or leave when this game is over. Let me go home. Let's see you. Zainab? Zainab? What's wrong with you? What happened? Mom, can you leave me alone, please? Katai? Is it Ruzgar, Zainab? You're beginning to see the end of the game you played, aren't you? Okay, Mom. Aunt on one hand, you on the other hand. I got it, okay? Don't push me or don't ask me questions. I'm going to Grandpa's mountain hut to rest my head. Oh, uh, Zainab, you're going alone? Will your grandfather allow this behavior? Mom, don't stand in my way again, okay? Don't you see that I feel so suffocated here? I'm getting ready and leaving. <laughs> 